Hey, my lovely TTs. Welcome back to the channel. We got a little bit of topics to get into. Let's go ahead and start this off with NBA Youngboy. Now, some people like to comment under my videos talking about, oh, Jasmine and NBA Youngboy, they broke up. They're not together. Where you been at? But that looks like that's not exactly true. Seeing as on NBA Youngboy's Never Broke Again LLC page was a picture posted of NBA Youngboy with Jasmine's hands over his face. Yes. So it looks like these two are still very much together. Now, in this picture, we can see that Jaslyn, she has a whole bunch of jewelry on, but we can also see that she has a ring on her finger, and it's looking like that's an engagement ring. Now, I don't know if you guys remember, but about three months ago, that's when a page called Shine Jewelers posted a ring and said, allegedly, this was the ring that NBA Youngboy got his girlfriend, Jaslyn. Well, this looks like the same ring that Jaslyn is rocking on her finger in this picture. So it looks like these two are very much engaged and plus Jaslyn's sister She basically admitted this by posting onto her insta story surprise with the ring emoji and she also put the bride's Emoji so I can almost guarantee that NBA young boy and Jaslyn are indeed engaged Y'all let me know what y'all feel about that. Also NBA young boy said mood. I need a hundred M's now child I wouldn't know what to do with a hundred M's. I would probably give it back what would you guys do if you had a hundred million let's go ahead and move on to our next topic which is going to be the baby so the baby posted onto his twitter and he wants to let everyone know that he hasn't been in any trouble in 10 days he said just in the baby has been out of controversies for 10 days in a row this is a new record for him congrats on the milestone the baby so the baby wants everybody to congratulate him he wants everybody to know that he hasn't been in any trouble for 10 days hopefully he can go a little longer than just 10 days now let's go ahead and move into our next topic which is going to be gonna young thug recently roddy rich posted on his insta story and it looks like he is missing his friend gonna he posted and he said free gonna we miss you out here champ mom's praying for you now if you guys don't already know yes young thug and gonna are locked up right now and recently news came out about three days ago that gonna was denied a bond Let's get into this article. It says Young Thug and Gunna will remain behind bars for the foreseeable future while Thug's attorney is still trying to negotiate bond. A judge flat out denied Gunna's release in court on Monday. The judge alleged that Gunna had a command role in the YSL Collective and set a trial date for January the 9th. 2023 the judge argued that Gunner's release would pose a you know what to the now a lot of fans got very concerned after they heard that gunna was denied a bond and a lot of people are hoping like his family his friends and like i said a lot of his fans are hoping that gunna is okay and young thug as well now like that article said young thug's attorney is still fighting for young thug to get bond but recently his longtime girlfriend jerica decided to speak out on the situation she posted and she said using rap lyrics in a trial Kyle is insane and now we know young thugs rap lyrics played a big part in this whole case or is playing a big part in this whole case and a lot of people see this as crazy and they see it as like she said in her words insane so a lot of people are still screaming and saying free young thug and free gonna let's go ahead and get into our last topic which is going to be mr corey now a lot of people might not be that fond of corey pritchett or carmen and corey's relationship because things that have happened in the past and things like that but i think a good thing on a positive tip about corey is one he's a great father and two he's always being motivating well recently he decided to open up on his facebook i guess word was going around that allegedly corey got handed everything by his father well he decided to clear up those rumors on Facebook and he said that's actually not true. He had to work hard for everything that he got. Let's get into what he posted. He said, they said my daddy rich and he helped me. My dad ain't give me ish. I work for everything that I got and he will tell you that. I took the knowledge from him and went and got my own. Then I got with my dad and now we building up all the land in our city and creating generational wealth. Take notes instead of disliking so much. They ain't going to teach you this in school 
SSG you dig so that's Corey basically clearing up those rumors now I don't know who started to spread those rumors but he definitely let fans and everyone know that no his dad is not rich his dad did not give him everything he actually had to work hard and make the money his so and it does seem like he has built up a lot of wealth seeing that he does have a beautiful house and he has a lot of cars and he's always going on Instagram live to motivate people encourage them to get out make money and do what they gotta do to be successful so that's a good thing about Corey. y'all let me know how y'all feel about all of these topics my lovely tts though in the comment section once again thank you so much for watching room for tea make sure you like comment and subscribe to my channel turn on your post notifications so you're notified every time i upload follow me on instagram at room for tea with two a's at the end and like i always say i will see you in my next video and i hope you guys have a blessed rest of your night